So we don't really know. And I've been going back and forth with the Zoom people, but that's not real fun. Oh, goodness. Okay. One Good. more question. Has anyone else been in your team page? Um, and the reason I say this is it happened between me and Rhonda. Like you gave permission to stream someone else to stream into your team page. I did then you probably need to go back and take access of that. So it's not allowing you because you don't have access to it. So let's see, how would I do that? Oh, that's a Rhonda question. <laughs> <laughs> I did do that while, um, because I think it was last Tuesday. Uh, no, it was um, the week before that. I'm not just real sure what their reasoning was, but we'll figure it out. Um, okay, well, good morning, everybody. Today is an actually, it's actually a really big day. Today, 10 years ago, I picked up the phone and ordered my Thrive. So today is a huge day for that. So we are definitely grateful for that. I'm grateful that I got home last night safely. Um, I had tons of kids over, um, got to hug my daughter and um, Maggie before I left. But y'all, I think it was Saturday. I shared, it was Saturday, I don't remember which day it was. Friday or Saturday, I did a, a screen record of Jelly Roll's speech from the CMAs and I cropped it down and I actually wrote my post myself. I actually wrote that. I didn't have Chitty Chat Girl post it. And as of this morning, there have been 1.5 thousand shares of my post. I don't... I, okay. So I, I am very grateful for that. That's super awesome. So um, last night, even one of my son's friends was like, why is your website for your Thrive not on that post? I was like, good idea. So I went back and I put it in there at the very end. Um, anyway, it might uh, be a <laughs> alternative motive, but who cares? Okay. So I want to hear your gratefuls, but we're going to say a prayer real quick. I know Maria's son is having surgery today. So we're going to pray for that. My dad has his chemo treatment today. So we're going to pray for that. If there's any other special prayer requests, will you please put them in the chat? And I will definitely pray for that today too. We are going to be working um, uh, Tammy's bingo card today. We're going to be doing all kinds of cool stuff. So let's get this rolling. So if you'll join me, dear Lord, thank you so much for this day. Thank you for opening up my mind, heart and eyes 10 years ago today. Thank you for all the people that have joined me along this path in the last 10 years. Thank you for allowing me to get home safely yesterday. Thank you for allowing me to um, spend time with my daughter and then yesterday time with my son and his friends. Just thank you for the huge blessings each and every day that we are receiving. Lord, thank you for this whole group that has shown up this morning or is watching back the recording. Thank you for just giving me this opportunity to share with people. And Lord, this morning, I want to come to a special prayer and ask for uh, just protection over cross and that surgery and everything goes well. I want to ask for special prayers for my dad today as he goes for an eight hour chemo treatment. I want to ask for just protection over all of our family, our friends, a, a abundant amount of angels protecting all of us, sounding trumpets and just keeping us all safe from harm. And I want to ask Lord that you just give us the words of wisdom to say and the new customers and the new promoters and the people just abundantly coming into our path. I want to just thank you for just being our business partner. We love you and we praise you in Jesus name. We pray. Amen. All right. Let's hear some gratefuls. Who's got some? Who's got some? Okay, y'all are awfully quiet today. Press the wrong button. I'll go. Super grateful. Um, had a girls' weekend and it was super duper nice. Um, and just I don't know, it was just a night. It actually it was so nice because we got to actually see leaves that were changing. You know, here we have like a tree every so often. So it was super pretty to be in Broken Bow. I would highly suggest if you're close to that area, that is a great, great, great place to go and visit. Um, secondly, just for a new week, I love Monday, fresh start, new week, new mind, new attitude, just all the things. So ready to kick butt and take names. Awesome. Oh, 
honestly want to say that I am on the corporate call today. I probably should have checked that out. I just saw it on my calendar. Okay. All right. Anybody else? Well, if we're all going to be quiet, I'm going to let y'all put it in the chat and we are going to get started with bingo. So here we go. Find two businesses that you that you use, hairstylist, dentist, mechanic, restaurant, doesn't matter, and leave a positive Facebook review. Let's go do that. We're going to spend five minutes. Find two businesses. Well, that's not going to be hard for me. <laughs> um, and go leave two positive Facebook reviews. Why is my phone making all that that's noise? Okay, moving on to the next thing. We're going to do our hero product in our stories. Like today, mine was my capsules, obviously. Um, put your hero product in your stories. Tell the viewers why you take it. I'm going to give you two minutes to do that. And then we're going to do what we did last Friday that absolutely changed so many things where we're going to add comments from somebody else. So go put your hero product in your stories and we're going to go from there. I am the corporate call today. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hey, Susan, so I have a question. So I'm not trying to be like a Debbie Downer on my stories, but how any tips for like trying to, so I want to put something like, even though my world feels like it's flipped upside down, I'm so thankful for the consistency. This is something I look forward to every morning. Does that make me sound like wah, wah, Debbie Downer? Or is that just being real and authentic and relatable? Sounds perfect to me. I mean, I've had to be that brutally honest over the last several months.
change up. It's me and Lindsay on the corporate call today. Yeah, seriously lied this whole time. I thought today was my 10 year anniversary. It's actually 11 17. So that's freaking hilarious. So let's change that around. Oh, good. That gives me time to like plan a 10 year anniversary picture. Um, okay. So that was your time up on putting your hero story in your product. So I am going to do my best to show you what we learned on Friday that was absolutely a game changer. I want all of you to go to Instagram and I want you to go to Lavelle's page, Lavelle official. Once you are there, I want you to scroll through and see if you can find a picture of the hero product you just posted. For instance, I found this one. I found this one on Lavelle's Instagram page. So once you go find that, whatever your hero product is. Okay. Now I want you to scroll down and go and look at the comments. Go find the comments. So here's one that says, these vitamins have helped me sort of new hots I never dreamed of. There's that comment right there. I want you to push it to the left and see that little plus sign. Is everybody with me right now? Anybody lost yet? Because I'll back up. When you see that little plus sign, click it. And it takes it to your Instagram page with that comment. It's somebody else's testimony about what these particular products are doing for them. Is everybody with me? That was literally a game changer on Friday. I have used it so many times now. Can you do that again? Yep. So go to Lavelle's Instagram page. Find the hero product you were talking about. Mine was absolutely actually my capsules today. So I found through their stuff, I found the capsules. Go down to their comments and view the comments that are on here. Find a comment you like. People were talking about shakes and stuff. I was like, I don't want to talk about that. I want to talk about what these capsules have done for you. When you find the capsule, move it to the left. And there's a plus sign there. When you hit that plus sign, I'm trying to do this backwards. It takes that comment with the picture of that product and puts it on your stories. So now you're sharing somebody else's testimony. By the way, it notifies them. So Laura Wells should probably see that I shared her product today. <coughs> hey, Susan. Yep. I did it. Well, I, I know where you are. I'm following you. I don't think it's available. It doesn't seem like it's available for the iPhone 12. Um, I updated to the latest uh, software update for the 12. Now, my husband has the 14 that shows up on his. So it could Anybody be. I have an iPhone 12 and I just did it perfectly fine. Oh, wow. Okay. So to me, it's Instagram just needs to be updated again. Because I honestly, I don't know when that became available because I just learned it on Friday. Jacqueline, mine doesn't do it either. So I think it's more of an Instagram up, update thing. So I'm with you. <laughs> and I'm afraid to reinstall Instagram because I'm afraid that I'm going to lose all my history. So I hadn't done no, it. Your, your account actually has your history. So as long okay. as you log back in as you, you should be fine. Okay. You'll lose your drafts. <clears throat> You'll lose drafts. You'll lose your drafts of all the reels you've done. So if you have a lot of drafts, I would not do it unless you just don't like those drafts. 
You won't You're lose okay your reels. Having them. Okay. You won't lose your reels because your reels are posted, but anything you have in your drafts, when you delete an app, you will lose that. So I can't swipe left or right, but if I hold my finger on it, it will select it. Okay, try that, Jacqueline. Yeah, I just figured that out too. I was like, oh, there is a loophole roundabout way to do it. <laughs> I think it must be an Android thing. All right. So um, that was just a little lesson there. We've done our hero product. We're going on to the next thing. Practice using that, y'all. I've used it all weekend. Create, oh, no, no, no. Sorry. Comment on at least one post in a customer Facebook group. If all of you, well, first of all, I'm in the wrong app. All of you should have a customer Facebook group that you're a part of or you have of your own. Okay, everybody done with that? Comment on at least one post in a customer group. Download a video from Lavelle Connect or an Insta Reel and repurpose it as a story on Insta. Well, I'm probably going to go do that with that Hero product again. So let's go to our Thrive Connect app. I'm going to go to videos. By the way, do y'all know when you open up your app, you need to like swap down first thing so it can update and put the latest and greatest stuff in there because they just do that. So go to the Thrive Connect app. Let's go find a product, download it, go find a reel, whatever. And repurpose it as your, sorry, um, on your stories. Somehow I just lost all the videos on Thrive Connect app. How did that? Oh, here we go. Oh, no.
thing is taking forever. Let me give you just a few more minutes to do that because I hadn't even got it to work yet. Why? Why are you going to be difficult? I got to work. Okay, y'all ready? We're moving on. So answer a post or a comment in one of your Facebook groups. So let's go to Facebook groups. Answer a post or a comment. Where are my groups? So the easiest way for me to do this is I go to my little circle down in the bottom and then I just find groups and I just start going and I can comment like crazy. I can probably sit here and do this for about three minutes and knock it out. So right now we are commenting in our Facebook groups. Okay. Uh, this is going to be fun. So go to your stories, either in Instagram or Facebook, wherever you probably get your most stuff and go down here to the bottom and look at your viewers and send five of those people. I just, Hey, thanks for watching my story. How are you? I haven't heard. How are you? That's it. Super, super easy. You got to message five people. Uh, 
And of course, my message will end with a question mark. How are you guys doing? That was a pretty good idea. That's a good way to start some fun conversations. All right, we're moving on. Create a re oh, okay, hang on. Okay, five minutes asking questions from posting your feed. So it's time to go through your feed. And start asking questions to non-thrivers. So we're going to do that for five minutes. Let's set a timer. This is building up our algorithm. So let's take it and run.
All right, moving on. Create a social media post that educates your ideal client. Use only a topic from your five list. So create a social media post that educates your ideal client. What is your ideal client? Do you know what your top things are that you want? So this is going to take us a little bit of time. T is Tammy on? Do I see her? No, just wondering if she had like an idea of how she was doing that. Well, you can always go to I can tell you what I'm going to do. Okay. I'm going because it's in my fives and I'm going to talk about like, <clears throat> well, it's in my stories already, but I'm going to make a post about how important it is to start your day off with just a daily devotion. Maybe you're not a book reader like me, but a small little single devotion because it's, it's talking in your fives list. Um, and I know Jesus is in my fives, right? And so I'm going to, that's kind of what I was thinking. Cause I'm like you, I'm an overthinker, but I'm like, crap, Lindsay, just put that in there and then they'll see it in your stories and they'll see it on your wall. So that's kind of the route I'm going to go. Can I just say that I'm grateful for Lavelle sending out weekly promos? I just realized there's a customer who has not ordered since 2016 that just placed her order yesterday. Um, and I'm pretty sure it's because Lavelle sent the email to her for the promo. So I'm very thankful for that. And I'll be reaching out to her today. Yay. Yes. And that goes along with the whole showing up daily because you never know who's watching consistency is key leanne uh reiterated that on our team zoom last night and so consistency is key but it's a daily showing up effort you have to show up every single day
All right, time's up. If you haven't finished that, go back and finish it later. Right now, it's time to go send the birthday messages. So I always go to Facebook and I search birthdays and all of them come up. And I go and start telling people after your birthday. I actually put their name on there now so it doesn't look like um, I'm just copying and pasting. Today is Callie's birthday. Miss Tiffany Deroff's daughter. Goodness, I had a lot of birthdays today. So, Tiffany, it's funny that today is Callie's. Yesterday was Joe Slayton's birthday. Aren't they related to you? They're related to you. Old friend of mine from high school that's actually related to Tiffany's girls. Crazy. I'm still sending birthday messages, but I kind of missed a few. <laughs> Yikes. I think I did. I better go check and make sure I did. Okay, all those people. Oh, 
11 through 13. Okay, next. So create a social media post. So we did that. Five minutes asking questions. We did that. Send birthday messages. Talk in your stories and share your morning routine outside of your Thrive. Hair care, exercise journal. That is something you will have to do throughout the day, which I we we do that all the time. As you go on a walk this afternoon, or, or if you go to the gym, or if you're out buying groceries and you find something that you think would be great for while you're thriving, um, anything. If you're going to get your hair done, it's always fun to take the before and after picture. That is something that goes in your stories throughout the day. So pick one training, live or replay, and watch and listen to it. Jot down your biggest takeaway. You could do that from this morning. We have mashup Monday at 1130, and then Lindsay and I will be on the corporate call at noon. Hopefully, we'll have something great to talk about. So pick one training, live or replay today, and jot down some notes what your biggest takeaway was. Maybe there's something that you hear one time or the other that you want to implement this week and make it go. So the last thing that's on the bingo card, obviously, obviously those last two things I just told you are throughout the day. Create a reel that gives a day in the life perspective of you. So Tammy's great at these because she's always talking about her. Um, what am I trying to say? Her her gardening stuff that she does. So create a reel that gives a day in the life of you. So I think mine's going to be showing the capsules, showing me making the shake, putting the patch on, going to the gym, shopping coming back and working. So there's going to be several clips that's going to make up that reel for the day. And I'll probably end it with taking my balance and going to bed. <laughs> so that reel will be, that reel will take a little bit of time today. So that's why it's super important to document everything about your day. I like that idea. So we have 14 minutes left. We're just going to continue working on those things. Unless some of you have some questions, then we will go from there. Good morning.
Can I ask a silly question? Always, but I'm sure it's not silly. What's the easiest way to enroll a customer referral? So I type the URL up in the Google thing and then go over to the three lines where it would say log in and right underneath it says create account. So, so mine, you know, doesn't. You it's a, mine does not. That's strange. It says account home, edit profile, change password, payment. Hold on. It's, Let me try to do this. I'm going to try to share my screen and see. Can you see my screen right now? Yes. Okay. So let's go. Let's try to type one in. So see. Mm. I need it to not do that. Okay. So like here's no. I want that out of there. Hold on. I'm trying to go to a customer. So I put the customer's URL up here. Right. Kept, why is it doing that? Because I got all these cookies. Is that why? See, I think that's what my problem is too. Okay. So log completely out. Okay. We want to do you're that. going to the customer website there I really didn't want to but sometimes I feel like I thought the other day it kept me from having to do that but when I got to this screen I yeah. should have been able no it didn't make me do that the other day hold on because see I can click on the website and normally I used to just click on the website and it would take you there and it would say referral a customer referral but it's not doing that now apparently I just had to completely log out and then it got, oh, me. there it is. Create an account. Yep. Same thing. So it just took a little bit to get there. It's okay. We're good now. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Thank you. You're never crazy. Has anyone had troubles with um, sending your invite link to someone and they end up creating an account or somebody else's link? I don't know if it was saved in their cookies. I send a ticket to support and they're like, well, the best thing to do would be just give their just directly give them your HTTPS hyphen hyphen and username da 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 versus. So now I'm a little leery to use the create invite in case it accidentally sends people to the wrong place. Has anybody else ran into that? I've not ran into that yet because I always create my own customer accounts. <laughs> so, um, and I actually sat with a promoter yesterday, and she's like, "Hey, what does this invite thing mean?" And I was like, "I don't know. I don't ever use it." Um, which is sad because I don't use it. Maybe that's why I haven't had any problems with it. Which so is password you make, Yeah. So password, you just make just a generic one and then tell them to just go in and change it if they like. Yeah. If you use the Thrive123 website, even with your customers, it will go back to the old way that we used to do it. So you can actually create their own usernames and it you kind of bypass all the other extra steps. Yeah. So what I used to do is just send people my direct link and then forward slash register and it'd bring them right to that customer page. And only kicker is then they can't decide if they want to be a customer or promoter just automatically makes them a customer. Well, I always like to set up everybody as a customer to begin with because you can flip to a promoter, but you cannot flip back to a customer. Very true. So as I'm creating their free accounts, it always goes in as a customer. It's been fun, ladies. I'm going to hop off the Christmas light, guys, here. Got to go. Merry Christmas. Have fun.
I better make sure you have a, something from the dollar store with her on Thursday <laughs> for your head. Oh, you know what we didn't do? We did not do a thing in our, our stories of us working together. So y'all have a two minute warning to get your cameras turned on. Sorry, I am still honestly, y'all, sending the private messages for birthdays. Is that ridiculous? Oh, okay, just finished this. I'm just going to say it's been a pleasure working with all these girls this morning. That's what I'm going to do. Whoa, whoa, where'd you go? I won't make you turn your camera on since it's kind of late in the game. But if you want to, you can. And if you want to wave, go ahead. Here we go. Good job, girls. I will tell you on my private messages in my birthday, anybody who's a current Thriver with me, I actually send them a 15% off code and say, hey, for your birthday, here's a 15% off code for you to use. They may not want it, but if they do, then they have it. So... So that's another thing on all those birthdays. I got to go look at it. If they're throbbers, I got to send them that. I hate when people um, try to be somebody else, do a fake post. I'm back to bother y'all. I have one more question. <laughs> when I'm creating this account. Yep. It says your promoter. Yeah, it does. It does always say that. It it will be the referral of the customer. Did it give them the opportunity? Did it say you're the customer of whatever? Yeah. And it gave her her, it was her name and her name's there, but this is truly a customer. She's not a promoter. I know that they, they've had that uh, issue already. It's been discussed before. I promise you she'll go in as a customer. Okay, thank you. Finally finished all that up. Okay, girls, we will see y'all. Um, or see y'all at eleven thirty on Wake Up and Win. Talk to you soon. Bye.